Hi, my name is Greg Zod. I'm at UCSF Diabetes Center, the Bluestone Laboratory, and today I'm going to show you how to transplant murine islets under the kidney capsule of diabetic mice. This procedure involves taking islets that have been purified from either syngenaic or allogeneic strain of mice, taking those islets, purifying them, and transplanting them under the kidney capsule of diabetic mice. Mice that can be naturally diabetic, like DNOD, or mice that are made diabetic artificially with the injection of streptocin. Now we're ready to handpick the eyelets. I'm going to handpick the eyelets and count them while I'm sucking them up with a pasture with a pipette. Uh, I'm going to leave behind any acinar tissue, and you can see just by the, the, the way the light's refracted in the tissue what is an islet and what's not an islet. And then I count the islets, I'll put them in a microcentrifuge tube, and we'll collect them for transplant. The islets have a more dense, almost reddish look to them, and the acinar is lighter and fluffier, and it also has like a whitish look. So we, you're going to get some acinar tissue while you do the islets, but as long as you grab a majority of islets, you'll be okay. And you can see there's a nice big piece of acinar tissue. 